my gators welcome back to the single mom versus the fixer upper so before this little quick haul it really ain't much that i'm getting remember i'm only working with twenty dollars and i actually found out i had two more dollars in my little cash envelope now here's the thing um i like to get my remote rewards so it depends on um how i feel when i go to the store if i'm going to i gotta put some oil on my face if i'm going to use my card and still stay within my budget or if i'm going to use cash and i did have some cash in here so all i have to get is some more crackers and Rizzy wants some yogurt and some granola and we need more crackers why because guess what? we still have the chili and the chili was so good today is the, the chili was so good that it it still lasts like we had it friday saturday sunday and then today she still wants it so i don't know if she wants sour cream but we already have cheese um i made a big fresh thing of green tea so we don't have to worry about that the orange juice is still thriving and doing its thing so that's gonna last another week or so um and i made the almond milk the other day i don't need to buy anything for that even if it did go low i make that myself and um the chips um these are the last of the chips i like to have chips around for the days i don't want to cook because i do have some ham is it even enough i do have some ham oh yeah we got more than enough ham that that'll last us um in case she wanted a sandwich sometimes she'll eat a sandwich if she's waiting for dinner her cuties are still doing their thing um my raisin bread mm, i might get another pack of this raisin bread yeah i like to have that on deck sometimes i'll just eat that with um coffee or cold coffee and we had the shortcake for um dessert tonight i don't know what we'll have for dessert unless we do another cake because we do still have some whipped cream I don't know. I'll probably find a, a dessert or something in there that I can um, get or make. Maybe I'll do some cinnamon rolls. Yeah, I'll probably do some cinnamon rolls um, or something. I don't know. But you'll know. We don't need any butter. We still got the regular butter. Um, I still got some of my country crock butter in this thing. So I got my wallet and my money ready. And um, I got to put the yogurt and I got to put the granola i gotta go to ups too i think that's all she wanted stink that's all you wanted was yogurt and granola i'm gonna get me some raisin bread i think we got enough onions and peppers and i think we have enough meat to do something um within uh this next week or so um because i think we'll do breakfast we were gonna do breakfast for something else but breakfast is gonna be one of our dinners so yeah Let's see. Let's see what this haul looks like. And um, was I able to sustain myself and not get because I am hungry. <laughs> Things I truly don't need and stay within the $20 budget. So, yeah, she wants ice cream because she's getting her braces put on. So we got crackers and then granola and yogurt and raisin bread. I think that's it. I think. OK, because nobody wrote anything else on there. So usually we write, usually here is where we write down everything, like um, what we need that's running out is a blessing. And I feel like that is so great to have in a house because someone could be the person that just drunk the last bit of juice, ate the last piece of bread or whatever. If you're not one that buy bulk and you tell them if you're eating the last of something and you see it's not that much, write it down write it down just in case the person i'm the type i'll come take a picture of it and then i'll go because i don't rip it off because i face to to do my thing so whatever i come back and get i'll check it off and then i'll continue writing on here so let me go get these groceries and you guys can go with me i'll do it this i'll do it where you guys go with me this time hopefully i have enough space to do it if i don't that means my camera didn't have space and i have time to clear it all right let's head to all these now technically it would have been um 64 instead of the 80 20 i think it was so really it would have been an extra 16 plus the 22 that i have that i have to work with that's what i'm keeping in mind if i had to go to the store and i had to go a little bit over i'll still think okay last week it wasn't that bad because i literally bought staples and what i'm going to do is adjust my budget to once a month there's going to be a budget that's a little bit bigger for the staple items so instead of 50 dollars every um week it'll be 50 dollars for three weeks and 75 dollars for one week would that give us um two hundred and twenty five dollars a month for us to eat on make meals and you know have all the things we need snacks and all that stuff so yeah all right let me get to all these and i'll go shop with me i'll be back 
I'm actually dropping off some stuff at UPS and one of the things if you didn't see that before you see this is that stainless steel cup that I end up buying to make my almond milk that I realized I didn't need because I have something that works so much better if you didn't check that video out remind me in the comments and I'll link it below if um, if it came out before this video Get back to the house and we're gonna talk all right we are here <clears throat> let's get in here we're home all right guys so i am back and i this is just more informative. All I got was the rounds. This was not on the list, um, but we needed some more eggs in our fruit. We didn't really need them. We're down to like eight eggs, I think. And I like to try to keep that thing at least two layers. And I think it's like one layer in a couple because I think six can go in each one or something like that. Yeah. So that's why I bought the eggs, um, which is a staple to have in the house. Rizzy wanted granola. These were kind of pricey. These, these, this was three sixty nine. Um, the eggs was one seventy seven. I wanted a snack. I was trying to do something and not go something so fattening. And I figured I wasn't gonna get those golden dusty ones I showed you guys because these right here are actually um, regular and they taste good with peanut butter and they taste good with ranch. And um, we don't we got ranch but we don't and, or French onion. If you haven't tried it, try it. So good with peanut butter and Nutella. Um, so it's like versatile. If I want something salty, I can do ranch. If I want something sweet, I can do these. So I decided to get pretzels for me. And I got her some um, yogurt. They did not have, and the yogurt was $3.79. Wasn't bad. It was $3.79 for the yogurt. Eggs 177, pretzels 198, and then the granola was 369. 
and the crackers was $2.49. So my total at Aldi's, and I paid cash, was $13.72. And so with that, wow, it literally is even because $13.72 times two is $22. So if I take the $13.72, Away from that, because I had $22. Ooh, ooh. 13 22 minus 13.72. It was at this very point that I realized I was wrong, or all the way wrong. Equals. Like, wait. Yeah, and I'm still like, wait, girl, like, uh, you're still wrong. It still ain't times two. Uh, let's get it together. And you confidently said it wrong. 1372. Yeah. Okay. So 22 minus 13.72 equals $8.28, um, which is... That's about $8.28. So, that's if I'm stick sticking to the $50 a week. But remember, the um, staples went over the budget last last um, time I went shopping. So, technically, we can add, I'll say, I, say, I can say we add $25 to that, which would be what I'm going to start doing for now. But we're going to stick to what it is right now because the new week... Um, uh, what we, we're at Monday. So hopefully this will pull us through this $8 to get us whatever we may need between now and then. We're going to do, I know we're going to do a sandwich day, sandwich and chips. I know we're going to do a breakfast day. Um, chili is today. So sandwich day, breakfast day, that's two days. And then I have some meat that I can make Salisbury steak. I have some meat. We have enough to pull us through. And I think like snack wise, Rizzy's not really a snacker unless I'm baking it or making it. So we should be fine. But if not, and we had to get something or we ran out of something, all our condiments are kind of full. We got $8.25 to do so. If not, this $8.25 will roll over and we'll have that for next week. So this is not, this is a mini haul, but not a, like one of the main weekly hauls. This is just like a in between. We need to a, a, grab a couple things. So those are the couple things I got. I would recommend, please go to the store with a belly with some food in it, okay? Cause everything looks so good. I promise you everything looks so good, but I did good. I get, did good. I stuck to the budget and stuck to the amount. I hope you guys like these videos. Talk to me in the comments. You know, I do this one-on-one -on -one with uh, the gators that reach out to me. Um, um, and people outside of here as well. I do this one-on-one, -on -one, help you learn to save money, how to budget the money that you get because not how much you make is what you do with it. All right, guys, don't want to drag this too long. Did you like this form of going to the store? I would do my major hauls like this too, like the bigger ones. Going to the store, seeing me get out, put the stuff in the car and all that. Do you like that? Talk to me in the comments. I definitely will talk back to you and I will see you guys in the next video. Later, Gators. Just wanted to stick this in here and put my eggs in here. I had a little bit more than I thought, so I'll have five eggs in here. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna put tuna on the list because that tuna or egg salad is something to stretch a day and have like a tuna or egg salad day. You can also eat that with crackers and everything. But let me show you what I do now. I forgot to put this in. I'm gonna stick this in somewhere. This is this is me editing, but having to come back. So what I'm gonna do is see here. Ice cream, I didn't get. Crackers, I got. Fruit, I got. Fruit? She put fruit? I don't... Is that fruit? Oh, yogurt and granola. Not sure why fruit was on there, but this will stay there to the next time. And so I'm going to put tuna because Rizzy wants tuna. She just said that. She like egg salad, but she'll rather tuna. So we'll have tuna. Um, and we got ice cream and we got more than enough eggs. So yeah, that's what we do. And make sure we keep track of it and take a picture before you walk out the door.